Hello guys and welcome to this drink review of Superman soda drink blue raspberry sour blue raspberry and uh, yeah it, that's just what it's called I actually thought it's gonna have an actual name but nope it's just called Superman soda drink okay there we go Oh man, even from this far, as soon as I open it, holy shit, that smells strong. Hmm. Yeah, it's, it smells like artificial blueberries. Yeah, that's no, not artificial blueberries, artificial raspberries. Oh, like that, just a generic berry smell. Holy shit, it is blue. Yeah. I'm not gonna have that much because it's not a sugar free drink and I am on keto. So it's gonna have this much. Uh, man, that's sour. Cool. It's super sour and super sweet. Ooh. Uh, so I can't really taste the flavor. <laughs> yeah, I mean, if you've had any kind of like blue raspberry flavor, it just tastes like that. I know blue raspberry is like a candy flavor, uh, but I don't know what it's based off. Uh, obviously, I don't think it's even based off uh, what's called raspberries. It's intended to mimic black cap raspberry. What's that? Oh, okay. I've never seen the raspberries like this. So that's what blue raspberry is supposed to taste like. It's supposed to taste like a black cap raspberry. And how they created it no originally was by mixing esters of banana, cherry, and pineapple. Huh. Alright, I did not know that. So, yeah. That's a drink. <laughs> Way too sweet. Maybe if you were to dilute it by like 50%. Maybe you would be able to... Ha I would be able to handle it. Uh... So that's probably what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna add like two two big ice pieces in that, and then just wait for them to melt. Um, so let's read. There are two comments. Might as well read them. Uh, first comment by Lazul. Next playthrough should be the single player mode of Pokemon Stadium One and Two. You're gonna do very well. Um, I don't think I have those games, and. Even if I did, well, I can actually check to see. Probably not. I mean, or at least they would be very, very low on, on my to-play list, right? Because, for example, I mean, like I said, if I'm going to stream, I've already decided I will be streaming that Clover game that you mentioned. So that's going to be like a streaming game. And then I kind of want to play Pokemon Upalo, Upalo, which is like a... A new region, like a fan-made region. And then I'm probably gonna do like some ROM hacks. Because I've done Gen 1 ROM hack. I'm doing it right now with Pokemon Yellow. I did the Gen 2 with Crystal and GS Chronicles. Um, Inclement Emerald was Gen 3. So I'm kind of want to do like... Through all of the all of the genres uh, generations, as well. So Pokemon Stadium, one and two, probably very 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 low on my to do list uh, when it comes to Pokemon. But who knows? Maybe in like ten years when everything else is over, maybe I'll do that. I mean, the thing is that I would rather play Pokemon XG, which is a ROM hack of Pokemon. 
Gale of XD, Gale of Darkness, that introduces a bunch of new stuff. Um, I think that is something that I would rather do, like go back to that and see, like, because, like I said, I've done a Let's Play of Pokemon XD, so not doing a Let's Play of Pokemon XG uh, would be fun, but that's in case, like, probably years and years in the future, I think. Yeah, I think, wait, I, there's one more comment. Uh, by Potato Hole. Um, please make a video of you telling your mom that she needs to leave the house because you're going to have an intense gunning session. And I don't know what that... I assume that's uh, masturbation, but I don't actually know. Yeah, it is. The answer is no, I'm not doing that.